And they're off in the in reality division of the FTBOA Florida Sire Stakes. It was an excellent beginning for Cajun's Magic, who's on the offensive early, but there goes the favorite Octane, and the matchup is on already as the two favorites sprint along. In tight toward the rail is Clapton. Shuffled back a bit there as one more score. Globes is on heels as Catton marches around. They're trying to slow things down on the front end, but they're stacking and packing field behind them. So up front, it's Octane, challenged now by Catton. These two now heads apart. Cajun's Magic was well served at the start, but he backs off. Three wide on the outside and big and classy. Chantel Sutherland has clapped in between horses. One more score, had to shuffle back. He's five wide now. Then it's Globes, a length and a half better than the skipper, too. Five, five, six champ is second last. The trailer is gold special as they make their way to the half mile mark. It's Octane on the inside, pressed along by Catton on the outside. Cajun's Magic is encouraged to keep up. He's now third. Clapton is there, fourth, one more score, fifth. Dropping back is big and classy, gold special passing some horses from the back then the skipper two out the back globes the trailer five five six champ as they round the four turn octane he's still the target three wide cajun's magic's gonna try to go after him catton is trying to hang tough with these top two these three are dominating with less than five sixteenths to run octane still the target from the outside cajun's magic is still trying catton's not going down without a fight he's third at the inside the rest are not of consequence as they straighten for the drive Octane, less than a quarter of a mile to go to the first finish line. Cajun's Magic in the Stonehenge colors tries to get to him. Octane almost home. Cajun's Magic has run a great race, but he's defeated by Arendelle Farms. Octane, who wins by two. Cajun's Magic second. They were well clear of Cat in third. The skipper two is fourth. In then it's Clapton for the high five.